there, today's going to be a video on the wallet that I designed for YouTuber Black Friday. Now this is the men's version of the wallet, so if you want to hear a little bit more about this, keep watching. Hey, I'm Evelina Zamori, welcome back to my channel, and I thought I'd better get my ass in gear and do this video because I need to tell you guys that this is nearly sold out, which I'm so happy about. It's almost like every time I release things now, they are selling out a lot quicker than they were, which for me is phenomenal. I only have 50 of these left, so I think there's 20 of the version without the sigil, so I'll go through it with you in more detail, but on the inside there, there would be no sigil, I have no sigil version, and 30 left of the one with the sigil. Black Friday and I are, of course, very proud of this little baby and our ever-expanding collection, and I love that ladies are really into this wallet as well. I know that some of you ladies don't like to carry the kitchen sink inside your handbag, as I do, and I wish I was like you, I just, I can't do it it's just it's it's too fucking small how do men do it it's also really cool for my brand to start seeing photos of men with my products thank you to any male out there that has purchased one of these and has sent me in a photo on instagram or facebook it's been really lovely to see so if you have been eyeing this please go to my site and either buy it or you can put it on lay by i think there's afterpay yes there is afterpay on there as well i think that's still only for australia possibly New Zealand. But Lebei is available worldwide. Okay, so this was super simple for me to design because it carried over the same batwing element that I had already designed for the wallet. So it was just a matter of transforming it into a, a smaller wallet that kind of had the same aesthetic, which is of course the black and red, which I am loving. So my husband has been using this for about six months. He loves it. It hasn't fallen apart or anything, which is really <laughs> important to know. And he wears it in his back right pocket. So he sits on it when he drives so it's getting squashed it still looks awesome so the quality is fantastic this is patent not PVC that's really important to mention even on my handbags and the wallets I always use patent it is a lot zero PVC is a lot thinner and it's going to basically disintegrate a lot sooner than patent wills a lot of people get those materials confused so I just wanted to clear that up so the men's one is pretty simple on the front absolutely plain on the back. On the inside you've just got card slips and for men I think that is the most important thing. The stamping here Black Friday by Avelina Demore and on this side you've got the sigil of Lucifer. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six card slots and then when you lift up that little window here there's a little zipper section. When I first started to design this wallet I put out a bit of a call on Instagram mainly to the male followers and said what do you want in a wallet? What's what's what do you need? <laughs> Beside it being aesthetically pleasing as fuck, what practical elements do you need? I very clearly remember someone writing to me and saying, please have a little zippered section. When I go out, I put my key in it. You know, I go to nightclubs or pubs or whatever, and all I take is my house key. And it's not secure enough in the pocket of my jeans, so put a zipper in it. So I listened to you, and I really like that. My husband doesn't use that section, but I'm sure one day he will. It's very handy. You know, you can put pills or keys or condom, whatever you need to be discreet about. And this little section here, just like the ladies wallet, is a slip where you can put your ID, a photo of your girlfriend or children, whatever you want to do. It's got the same matching red velvet as well. One thing that I really wanted to achieve throughout the whole set was to have the same color scheme. So I said to my manufacturer, don't you be changing this on me because I did that previously. I'm not going to go into that, but I confirmed the color and then they made the bulk order for me and they changed the material. They didn't tell me and I didn't realize until 200 bags arrived and I'm like, this is not I wasn't happy and I said, guys, you cannot do that. The color scheme for my brand is so important. So if you were to buy the matching ladies wallet and like you and your man want to be matching, you can entirely do that. It is exactly the same material. Two more really noteworthy features are that the inside is also lined with red. I love that. Just a little pop of color when you open it up to get your notes. And the other thing is the little eyelet there. So you can put that wallet chain on it. A lot of men use that and I think it's so sexy. It's very metal. Oh God, we're talking about goth, not metal. God forbid. <laughs> anyway, if you do have one of these chains, you can put that on there. That's probably the shortest video I've ever done. I don't know if I'm getting older and I'm just like 
I'm gonna get to the point and just tell you what you need to know. Or if I'm summarizing, let me know <laughs> if you feel like this was just too quick. Black Friday and I are working on other products. We've definitely heard your call for a matching makeup bag. So I will get a sample started on that ASAP. We also have a compact mirror that we're working on, changing the subject a little bit. I'm also starting to design my handbag for Danny Divine. So in the next few months, there's going to be a lot of sneak peeks of designs that I'm working on, a lot of samples started, and then the end of 2019 is going to be boom, 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 new products. I'm also starting on the version two of the Death Candy Coffin. And I ran a poll on Instagram asking you if one of the new colors should be pumpkin orange, and there was an overwhelming yes. And I said, what if it's not available by Halloween though? Yes, it depends on where orders go. I cannot guarantee its availability by Halloween. Do you still want it? And you guys said, yes, we do. So there you go. That is going to be one of the new colors available in the Death Candy wallet, as well as a few little minor changes like the removing of the mirror, because if you bought one or you bought a bag that has a mirror in it, you know there was fucking drama with that. I don't need that in my life. So no more mirrors in anything, I will make my own compact mirrors and they will fucking kick ass. I can see them in my head. I just need the time to sit down at my table and design it and get samples going and boom, very excited about that. So again, only 50 of these left. We had 200 made. We have 20 of the no sigil and 30 of the version with sigil. So please be quick if you do want to get your hands on one of these. If you're wondering about this lovely dress, it is by Current Mood and I got it from Dolls Kill. It just arrived this week. It is going to be part of that massive haul that I keep talking about. The problem with that haul is I keep buying things from Dolls Kill. So the haul keeps getting bigger, bigger, bigger. I will do it next week, I promise. And tomorrow I will be filming my Q&A. So if you haven't already, head over to that video where I ask you guys for questions and that will be where I'm reading from when I film that. Please like and comment on this video. It does help my channel a lot. Another big hello to all my new subscribers and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.